First of all, I don't think that art has anything to do with nationality. So uh, you, it always amuses me when somebody says Canadian artist. There's no such thing as a Canadian. You're an artist or you're not. It has nothing to do with where you come from. I mean, the influences may have something to do with them, but you are, a, you are an artist. That would go great. You say, oh, my God, I've got to go and see Rachmaninoff play the piano. You know, he's Russian, you know. <laughs> Who gives a shit? He's a great artist. And it has nothing to do with boundaries. You have to break them, no matter where you are. So what is this? I, so I gave up thinking about it. I gave up worrying about that problem. In fact, I don't give a damn anymore. And if they want to close something after three weeks and it's a hit everywhere else, that's their problem. It's, it's, I'm, I'm sick and tired of it. Um, if it's good and it's terrific, it should be accepted, no matter, no matter what nationality you belong to. Um, am I making that clear? I just think that it has no, nothing to do with borders. and We are world citizens, really. We should be. And we'll come here and do things. Oh, I do all the time. There is a certain adolescence to saying someone is a Canadian artist, or I'm a Ukrainian artist, or yeah. a, you know, I'm yeah. a barbarian artist. There is an adolescence implied in that. Yeah. Whereas you say, if you actually grow up, then you're just an artist. Glenn Gould was an artist. He's a world artist. Yeah. But it is, I don't know, a stage of where we're at. Yeah, I know. That's, that actually, people have to think like that. It's, a, it's, yeah. it's a disaster to begin with.